Hello everyone, welcome back to MathMo. Today we have an interesting algebra problem. We need to simplify this. We have 99 to the power 100 over 33 to the power 50. How can you solve this? On the first side, this question is real hard because we have so huge power, but if we write this 100 as <coughs> 50 times 50, so what we will have? We will have 99 to the power 50 plus 50 and all over 33 to the 50th power. So we write this 100 as a sum, 50 plus 50. What are we going to do next? We all know the rule. If we have a to the power x plus b, we can write it as a to the power x times a to the power b. So as a result, we will have 99 to the power 50 and times 99 to the power 50 as well. And all over these the same, 33 to the power 50. So we just simplify this using this rule. What are we going to do next? Let's group these. 33 and 99. So let's use, let's group these two values with this power 50. As a result, we will have this one 99 to the power 50 and this one multiplying. We group this. We can do this because this is a product, so nothing changed. If we group this, we will have 99 to the power 50 all over 33 to the power 50. And take a look. This is a really good case to use our rule. So if we have Right here we have a to the power x over b to the power x. If we have the same powers but different exponent, we can write it in one parenthesis. So a over b raised to the power x. So we can write these as, I write it right here, so this is the same 99 to the power 50. And right here we can write this as 99 over 33 to the power 50. So times 99 over 33 and all raised to the power 50. And take a look, we can simplify this in our parentheses, so as a result we will have 99 divided by 33, it will be 3. So as a result we will have 99 to the power 50 times 3 to the power 50. And the last step, we will know that if we have a to the power x times b to the power x, so different bases but same exponent, we can write it as a times b all raised to the power x. So we can write this as product to the power x. So as a result, we'll have our final answer, 99 times 3, all raised to the power 50. Last step, multiplying this, we will have 296, 97 to the power 50. And this will be our, will be our answer. So if you have any question, if you have any suggestion, maybe you have faster method how to solve it, write a suggestion in the comment, it will be really interesting to read it. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos.